hello beautiful people welcome to another video with your girl siobhan welcome back welcome back thank you so much for joining me for another video i really appreciate you spending a little bit of time with me today i wanted to come on and do a quick video showing you how i'm getting my house ready before we leave to go on vacation there's a few things i wanted to get done as well as cleaning out and organizing those black bins right there that has like the air fryer and microwave on top i am going to be running to a few stores because i wanted to get some more um, luggage or or baggage to take with us for vacation so i want to do that really quickly as well as just again get the house in order before we leave so thank you again for joining me. I really hope you enjoy the video. I hope you get some motivation. I hope that y'all are all doing well and I appreciate you all. I have videos coming back to back because I want to make sure that I just keep the videos coming. I'm really enjoying everything and yeah, I just appreciate y'all. So let's hop into the video. No more talking for a few minutes <laughs> and let's get into it. I want to just make sure that I am getting done what I need to get done. And I hope you are getting done what you need to get done as well. So let's get to it. All right, bye. So I was absolutely determined to get the kitchen done before we left to go on vacation. I wanted to make sure that everything was cleaned and decluttered. So those black bins that you'll see there, I'm going to pull those out momentarily. Now, this was a very, very busy day, very busy day, <laughs> but in a very good way, good way. So I'm getting done with the kitchen as much as I can. And then London is having a end of the work I guess because she did like a learn and earn work program for the summer. She's having an end of the week, like graduation, end of the program graduation. So I'm going to be taking her to that. But before I left, I was like, let me get as much done as I possibly can. And then when I come back, I can kind of finish up. So I wanted to wipe off the counters. I did. You'll see me start organizing the black bins momentarily. And I am going to be redoing my counters here not today in this video but very soon because i want to just have the counters be as minimal as possible i really don't have a lot of counter space it's nice to have the island but really i don't have a lot of counter space so i want to make sure that i don't use unnecessary counter space if i don't need to so you'll see me get this together probably in another video so i'm going to load the dishwasher after i unload it basically and then we're going to start cleaning the black bins which is nice and we're going to go from there you, you, you. you said you want a bad one well baby i'm as bad as they come you said you want a hot one yeah, yeah. you with the hottest under the sun but be careful what you wish for make you eat your words if i'm more than what you bargain for fun to flirt but promise to deliver much is required cause look at what i'm giving you you ain't really ready for real One of my pet peeves is having stuff in my sink. I do clean my sink out multiple times per day and I do not use the same rag that I will use on the dishes or dish rag, whatever you want to call it. I don't use the same one. So I will use like a microfiber cloth or something like that to clean out the sink. And I don't know, it's just a pet peeve of mine. I don't like things in my sink. And I'm trying to get the kids to understand that it is okay to rinse out your dish, your bowl, your plate, and put it into the dishwasher. You don't have to keep filling up the sink. Put in the dishwasher, and then when the dishwasher is ready, we can load it or we can start it and keep it moving. But again, that's one of my pet peeves is having a ton of stuff in the sink. I don't like it. It drives me absolutely bananas. <laughs> Really ready, ready. Won't be faithful to someone. I'll 
So I'm starting with this black bin over here. And I have, it was like a junk drawer, to be honest with you. It was random stuff. It was cleaning stuff. It was, oh, I did have a few cleaning supplies in here. And just like I said, oh, I had some uh, more bug spray in there, some refrigerator liners. I had all kind of stuff in there, guys. I had some, what is it? Like Italian, not Italian, um, Chinese duck sauce soy sauce packets and things like that so got rid of a ton of stuff in there also i had a few little decor items in there that i gave away and yeah i'm just going through like i said i wanted to make sure that i purged as much as i can got rid of a ton of stuff because there's no need to keep items that i am no longer using or that i haven't used in a while so if I haven't used it in six months to a year, it's time to go. I'm not going to use it and it is okay. That's what I have to tell myself. It is okay. So I apologize for the angle. I know it's not the best, but you can see me going through. It's like, it reminded me of Mary Poppins where she just kept digging and digging and things just kept coming out. <laughs> yes, that's what I felt like. So I'm going to start cleaning these out. I am going to run out. I was invited to a, another end of the summer work program graduation i'm gonna go see the kids i took them some cupcakes and cookies and things and then i'm going to come back pick up london and take her to her end of the summer graduation as well so like i said it was super busy so london's end of the summer graduation was in the waterfront and that's where the stores are and you'll see me run into a few stores just to pick up things while she's going to her end of the summer graduation Hey beautiful people, so I gotta pick up a few things. This is like my last day of running around for a vacation. So I'm actually at Ross. I do need to hit TJ Maxx and um, possibly Target. So let's make this really quick because I wanna start packing or finish up packing today. Ross, here we go. Try and make this really quick. So I'm looking at these bags right here for the twins. It's a pink Adidas and the black and white one. They're $12.99. Not bad at all. And they just had a couple little bags over here, which I think I'm gonna look in the kids section too and see what they have. But these will do for packing their stuff, I think. So they do have some bags over here, the kids side. So this cheer bag right here is probably what, 25? No, oh. this is only 10.99, but I don't know if they can fit everything in here. So I'm gonna take that one and see. This one is probably like similar size. Let me see, how much is this one? 8.99, um, let's see. yeah it's all the bags that i'm seeing that this little bed for our dog is so cute it's so cute it is 55.99 but this is so stinking adorable that's really adorable i love it and look they have another couch up here for 49.99 it's really cute I had to show y'all these pictures. So this one is $24.99 and it's really a nice size. I don't know how big it is, but it's really a nice size. $24.99. I like this one as well. This one is $39.99 and this one over here is $29.99. I like all three of these. This one and that one is my favorite, but oh my gosh. I have no, of course, nowhere to put it, but this would be perfect, like, if I did my bedroom, this color, well, my bed, like, it would go in my bedroom. This is so pretty. That is so pretty. Y'all know I had to look at the home decor before we left, because <laughs> I got everything that I need out of here. I'm getting ready to go. I got things to do, but this little gold head, black head, gosh, I don't think I could do it. $24.99. I like that. My face is different back there. That's about it that I see. Really, not much else. 
these marble trays are just gorgeous. So this is $12.99, this right here. And that's really pretty. And then these marble trays are $9.99. Are you kidding me? Wow, so pretty. I mean, they are heavy. They are so heavy. I like that a lot. I might have to get that. Oh my goodness. That is so pretty. These are pretty too, guys. Like the risers. These are only $4.99. These are only $4.99. Look at this. Well, I don't see a price on it, but. Wow. So pretty. What is this behind here? A bird on a tree. They got these. If you're like a neutral person, $9.99. That is so pretty. This gold bowl down here is pretty too. I can see like entryway, $12.99. But I like the tray and I like this a lot too. It's a spoon rest, $6.99. I do like my spoon rest because I can hang it on the stove and kind of get it out the way, but I like this. This is really pretty for $6.99. And then look at this. These are really pretty as well for $5.99. $5.99. Dang, I don't know. I'm torn, I'm torn. I have this one over here. Oh, this is super heavy. $10.99. $10.99 for this. I'm afraid this would fall and crack something. Like this, it's that heavy. Now I'm running into Target. I'm gonna get a few things. And then I think I'm gonna go get my nails done while I have a couple minutes. These are really cute. They look like a mercury glass, but they're plastic and they light up. They're $5. So they have a tall and a short, small. And this one is $5 as well. But those are cute. I'm going to take an extension cord since I know for a fact that we're going to be plugging in a ton of stuff. So I think I should get, maybe I have extension cords at home. I just got to remember to bring them. Okay. Got to remember to bring them. Oh, look at this. This is so cute. Three. So six times one is what is going to be six math spinner i like this i like this a lot this is three and i like this one too word spinner so spell coat c-o-a-t i like that modeling Three dollars. Oh, this is a blank book. Blank book that they can eight sheets. What is this? Four. Okay, for little littles. Oh, this is a uh, sense and grow sensory sand tray space travel. Kay would love something like this. I know she would. How much is this? Sorry guys, my allergies are messing with me. I, I don't see a price. I'm, for 10 play, I'm assuming it's $3. Oh, but they have the Polar. One bag of snow powder. Oh my gosh, my head is itching. Ooh. Okay, I think I might get these. What is this? <laughs> They even got the Halloween stuff out. Like, I mean, I know people are putting Halloween stuff out, but they, like, this is really cute. Like, I like that shirt a lot. This is the Be Rooted collection. And 
the little pencil pouches. Look how cute these are. Little journals for $12.99. This one. If you know, you know. So cute. This one is $14.99. Oh my goodness. I like this too. My weekly plans. That's $12.99. And this. That is so cute for $14.99. So cute. So. Woman on the go. This is $8. $7.99. So we have this. Instead of like two, four, six, eight. That's about equivalent. I'm going to see what else they have. Um. I want the toothbrush and toothpaste together. I've never seen this. The Jergens Melanin Glow with gold luminizers, cocoa and shea. I might have to get this and try it. It's $8.99. It's $8.99. So I might have to get that. Now these are my favorite lotions and I have all of them i've had all of them but pomegranate and the vanilla cashmere smell the best they all smell super good but definitely recommend these so i got the toothpaste Let me go this way. Me get some toothbrushes, like a pack of toothbrushes for them. Oh, we don't. I have a big thing of tissue in the truck. Let's see. This is Bio True 24 Hours of Hydration Multi Purpose Contact Lens Solution. Okay. Um, I have Tylenol and I have a lint brush, I have all of that. I'm a though extra gentle you get 20 wipes in here I'm gonna get two of these okay this is five so beautiful people what I'm about to do really quickly because I'll have the stuff that I'm donating I'm actually gonna put it in my truck and take it to uh, the Goodwill or wherever so that I can donate it I'm gonna clean these out real quick because I have extra decor and stuff in here that I'm going to get rid of and I just want to make sure that I can do like a quick trip. This, I only have a couple days before we go on vacation, so I want to try and organize this. That way I can focus on packing and different stuff for a vacation. So let's get this done so that I can take the stuff to Goodwill and drop it off. Or the, I could do the red, white, and blue, but with the red, white, and blue, I have to schedule an appointment, have them come and pick it up, and all of that. I may do that. Either way, we're getting it out the house today. And it's a ticket talking mother for the biggest. That's a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it. And it's a ticket talking mother for the biggest. That's a comma and a comma and a comma. Gotta get it. And this is expired. This is why I don't like to buy stuff in bulk, really. I know that sounds crazy with a large family. But I bought these um, Kraft macaroni and cheeses from Sam's Club. I think I got like 10 packs. 10 packs. Oh, <laughs> 
So I know you're probably wondering like, what does she have in the bins? So at first, one bin was supposed to be for coffee, another one was supposed to be for tea, and then I had snacks in one of the bins that couldn't fit in the snack drawer or snack closet at one point. I have some stuff that was for making my soaps and body butters, and then I had like cleaning supplies and extra food storage. A lot of that is now gone because I don't need it. Oh, that was extra, that was coffee beings that someone gave gifted me for Christmas that I needed to get rid of. I don't even have a coffee grinder or anything like that. I was just holding on to stuff that I really did not need to hold on to, as you can see. So these snacks that were in one of the bins, the kids were not eating them. They didn't like them. They had expired, so I'm going to get rid of those. I had some extra cookie stuff. It was just a lot going on that, like I said, out of sight, out of mind. I wasn't looking at it. I wasn't thinking about it. I didn't know that we had a ton of bread and I ended up buying more bread. One of the bins was full of bread, crazy. There's our doggy. Say hi, Lee. Lee. Lee, 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 Lee. Hi. Hi, wait, she's out of the frame. Go put her back, go, yeah, go back, Lee. Now turn around, say hi. Hi, Lee, Lee. Hi, Lee. You want a snack? Hold on, let me get you a doggy treat. Mom, she didn't even eat anything yet. It's a treat. <laughs> So I know I did have a lot of comments about people um, saying like, wow, a lot of food was wasted. And it was. I'm not saying that a lot of food was wasted. It was because, again, it, it basically was out of sight. So nobody was thinking about it. And then a lot of it expired, guys. That's really what it was. It expired. So I put things away. It was organized. I do have labels, too. So everything will be labeled. But a lot of things were put away and they weren't thought about after that. They really weren't. So I don't recommend that. It is unfortunate. I don't want to do that ever again. But yes, a lot of food did get tossed away because it had expired and it was no longer good. And the kids, of course, they didn't like it. So I didn't know. So that's the way it goes. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I always have on music when I'm cleaning, organizing, cooking. It doesn't matter. I have several different um, 
I don't want to say the name because she'll probably start working right now, but I have several different um, devices that are connected that will play music wherever I go, kind of throughout the home, which is nice. Well, not throughout the home, but around the home, which is nice. So anyway, I'm going through, like I said, a lot of bins were emptied out and it was just nice to have that extra space. I did tell y'all that I had some more cleaning supplies and yeah, I'm going to keep all of my cleaning supplies. Um, someone was saying to just do vinegar and water and essential oils, which I know I can do that. I know I can do that. And I, it's just, I like cleaning supplies. I like the smell of different things and that's, that's my love. That's what I like to do. That's what I like to do with my time. I couldn't wait to do it, to be honest with you. So back to getting these bins all done. And then I'm going to sweep the floor. I'm not sure if I show you in this video, but I did sweep and mop in this video. Well, on this day. And if you're wondering about the dress, this is the dress that I got from Walmart. It was $10. They did have multiple colors, which was really nice. It's super soft and comfortable, guys. I mean, so soft and comfortable. I went back to go get another one and they didn't have my size. So that was just God telling me, girl, you got enough. Okay. You got enough. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> let me finish getting the kitchen together and yeah, see what else we got to do during this day. Usually I don't post. Usually I don't post, but I want the world to know. Time to pull a drop top out. Summer nights, it's a this is what I'm getting rid of. So I did have a soda stream. I actually donated it. I got the soda stream. I never really used it, so I, I donated it. Um, but I got this, this, old sugar container. Someone lost the, I mean, not lost. Ayana had broke the lid. And then this is a coffee mug. Nothing wrong with it. Never used at all. I know for a fact it's not going to fit in like my car holder and I like the ones that will fit in my car holder. That's the ice and chain. And then these are for hot food, which you can always use these, but I haven't used them. This is well, you a... Can give me huh? So you can give, you can give me if you want it. So then we have this right here that covers the pot so you don't get splattered. And this is a wood browser that I got from Target Dollar Spot for $5. And I don't really have a need for it. So if you want any of it, G, you can have it, of course. But that's everything for right now. I need to clean off the stove. Um, I gotta clean up this mess and I wanna show you what I got from Ross and T Target, Ross and Target. So beautiful people, I'm gonna show you what I got from the stores really quickly. I did like a quick little um, walk through, but I got this. G, tell me what you think. Oh, that's cute. Ain't that cute? This was only $8.99 for Ross. $8.99, I got that. I got this Adidas bag. What? No, 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 that, that's the twins, that's Stan. That bless sign goes in my room. That's from my- Oh, wait, this stuff you're keeping in your Yes. Oh, I you were all this no, time. the other, sorry, my daughter is going through the stuff I'm giving away. I was about to say, what's that? Yeah, no, I'm keeping that stuff in. Why not? I mean, you can give it to me. Anyway, I, I know, that's, that's the stuff that I had, you know. I haven't talked about it yet on my channel, so I don't want to talk about it yet. Okay. Anyway, I got this Adidas bag right here. It was $12.99, so I got this one. And then I got this other Adidas bag, same size. It was $12.99. So I got two Adidas bags, and it, they're basically called a Diablo Small Two Duffel. So I got a, it's called a cargo, it's a cargo thing that goes on top of my truck that we can keep our luggage in. Now I'm having the kids, I'm gonna help them pack, and we're gonna pack everything very compact because the truck is going to be full. Gee, look. Oh, you lost Super cute. They only had one of these, so I got this. This was only ten. I think it was. This was ten ninety nine, guys. Ten ninety nine. Ten ninety nine. So of course I got other things that we could pack, but ten ninety nine. Ninja work? Yeah, it works. I just don't want it anymore. It's a ninja blender. I, I just it comes with a whole bunch of different attachments. I just don't want it. Or this one. It's fine. 
and I have this. So these are, this is some of the luggage that we're taking with us. Way more than enough. Um, and then again, like I said, I have stuff upstairs. All of the, um, all of the soaps, lotions, and all that stuff will, for me and the twins will be packed with my stuff. And Chris and London, G, they're all going to pack their own, of course, their soaps, lotions, and all that. So let me show you what else I got. That's yours. I want to go through the stuff in the basement, but I want to wait until I come back from vacation because right now I got too much going on. Um, so I did get, this is called a sensory snow toy. And I think this is going to be cute for Kate and Kinsley. I got two, two of them. So these were only $3 a piece. And then we, of course, got this where they can spell different words. I am having the twins do the IXL app. IXL. So they will be, they have a month before they go back to school. I'm going to say they have about 25 days before they go back to school. So they are. And this whole summer, they have been doing an hour of reading and an hour of math. We also have this, which is going to work on their timetables, um, some addition, you know, math stuff. And then I did get this, G. Look, this is the Jergens. It's called Melanin Glow Illuminating Moisturizer. I don't know how it smells. But yeah, it seems like it'll be I want to try it. Mm -hmm. I got everybody has a toothbrush. And I got everybody toothpaste. Can you say that for room yet? Yeah, hold on. Y'all all got so Cadence Kinsley. No coffee degree. Oh no, I needed one more. That's okay. I got things that go on our toothbrushes. Mm -hmm. I have okay. those for me and you. So this is Kate, Kate and Kinsley, Chris and London. Okay. I have the caps up, upstairs. I really like the Lumi um, acidified body wash. I just used the last of the orange one, the uh, tangerine. So I got this one, which is lavender sage. You only need a little bit of this to wash up with, and it works really well. This is fifteen dollars. This <laughs> is fifteen dollars. Wow. Yes, but it really works really well. So I like it. That's just me. I usually will wash up once with this and then I'll wash up with other soap, the soap that I've made or the body wash or whatever, and then I wash up again. But that's just me. <clears throat> I, I overdo it. You know I overdo products. Anyway, we're taking these, which is the wet wipes. I got us some Listerine. Um... There's another toothpick, oh, and some tampons, you know, because, and I'm going to tap some, just in case somebody needs them, I want to make sure we have everything we need, so hold on, I got a few more things, and I'll show you, again, we didn't, I didn't need to buy, like, lotions and soap, I mean, yeah, I got two bottles, two big bottles of soap, and, huh, this is toys for them, it's like a sensory play, which oh, is like okay. hand they like to feel yeah mm -hmm. yeah Kate Kate is really big into sensory play um I don't want them to be on our iPads 24 7 but this will give them something to do yeah, especially if like Brooke wants to come over so Troy's coming Troy said he wants to come that's what Shana said but okay and then because y'all know anyway I went to Ross I couldn't pass these up so I usually don't show things like this, but anyway, I got my son some Aeropostale boxers and some Champion boxers. I made that real quick because y'all need to see all that. And then I got some more socks because you can never have too many socks when you have kids. So I got some more socks. And then they had um, hipster underwear, so I got London and Joanna. Yep, and G, a pair <laughs> of one, two, three. Everybody got underwear, so whatever. And then y'all know I, I got a problem, but we already know this. We all got problems. At least I'm not doing something that I shouldn't be doing illegal. Anyway, I had to get these because these are just too cute. And these are just, they're just biker shorts that they could throw on with the top or even if they sleep in or whatever. And they were only $5 for three pairs. So I think it was five. Where's the tag? Girl, I don't see the tag. I'm pretty sure these were five dollars for, for three, five ninety nine maybe for three pair. So two four six dollars. So that's. Um, is there one more bag over there, G? Huh? 
Put them on the floor. Okay. Let me finish it with that. Oh. Yeah, so London got this pencil case. She also got this Be Rooted, these pens. And I think these are cute. It says, I am confident, I am worthy, I am capable, I am enough. Yeah. These pens, yeah. I'm all about positivity. Ask my kids. <laughs> they know. We got some Tylenol to take with us. Um, I got some batteries. And these are for my, um, I got some box lights upstairs that I need. Anyway, we got this, which is Sweet Ginger Cleansing Rinse, G, Castor, and um, Aniseed Oil. It's the wrencher here. Oh. I got um, edge control, two of these edge controls right here, because Kay needs to get her hair done. I also got this Shine and Jam right here, and then I also got this, which is really good. It's a, um, have you ever seen it? Uh, strength and Shine Leave-In Conditioner, but it's really good. Especially like if you get your hair braided and you want to spread in there, this is really good. I really like this stuff. I know, so she picked out the stuff that she wants, <laughs> which I'm glad because, and I have other stuff, so what I'm gonna do is- You showed them this already? Huh? You know. Yeah, you can show them if you want, but I washed it out and everything. Yeah. So it's nice and clean. I, I love the coat. Yep. I got three of those. Two. And I got this. I need to go up to this. Towel holder? Yep. Yep, I like the glue. Let's go. And we have my receipts that I need to scan for fetch. Starbucks? Starbucks? Mm -hmm. uh, I got a, um, a caramel frap with almond milk. And I didn't drink it really. I drank a couple sips. Oh, and this, this is my sausage, egg, and cheese. I just didn't, I don't try to eat, I don't even drink at the same time, no, you know, so I need to, but that's it. Anyway, I need to go and finish up some homework, and then I have class, and then once I'm done with that, I'm going to, I want to sweep them up in here, and then I'm going to move into the dining room. I have three baskets of clothes that need to be folded, as well as we're washing more clothes downstairs. Um, G, don't forget to put those in the washer for me. Yeah, I'm about to take this downstairs right. and then do that. All right, thank you. You want to put it, is there, do I have another Aldi bag that you can put it in? No. It might, there's some downstairs. Yeah, I'll figure it out. Yeah, there's some downstairs, so. I'm I'm actually, that. I think I have a tub down there. Do you? I think I have a clear tub with some of my stuff down there. I'll just okay. put it in there. All right. And then, um, so the, the kitchen is basically almost clean. I still want to wash the fruit real quick, cut up the pineapple and the, um, the other piece of fruit here, the cantaloupe, couldn't even make up the name. Cut up the cantaloupe. Um, I want to clean the stove, and that's pretty much it. But everything has been organized. These are all cleaned out and organized. I need to clean the refrigerator out, which I'll try to get to. But I want to re really want to move through the rest of the house. But the kids have their designated jobs that they need to do because I would love for my house to be clean prior to leaving so we can come home and at least have a clean home. So I'm going to go and get my homework done. And then the twins are at their, this is their final summer camp day. Final summer camp day. So they're there right now. I don't have to pick them up for a little while, which is super nice. I don't gotta pick them up till 6.30. So that's really nice. And um, other than that, that's it. You're gonna see me packing and stuff that's coming, but right now I'm in the process of just trying to get the house in order and then we can lay out everything as we pack, pack it all up. Tomorrow, I'm going to go get my hair cut, my nails done, my eyebrows done. My toes and my feet look perfectly fine. So, I mean, I could do, they have, my toes haven't grown out at all, my toenails. Um, so we'll see about that, but I definitely wanna get my hair, eyebrows, nails done. I wanna get my car, my truck washed and vacuumed out and that should be it and then get everything packed up as much as possible because i have the family cookout to go to and there's a girls night that i'm supposed to do if i got everything packed and done i'll go if not then i'm not gonna be able to make it hey beautiful people so this is my dining room area a lot of it is as you can see clothes some new paper towels i gotta clear off the table i'm trying to get stuff ready to be packed so I'm just going to start working in here and start getting it together.
So the first thing I need to do is get the stuff that I'm going to be donating. I put that stuff in this garbage bag. I have two garbage bags worth of stuff that I'm donating right now. And then I have some other stuff. I'm going to get the paper towels up. I am going to load the beverage fridge with the water. You won't see that, but I'm going to get the water together. Look at all this stuff that I'm donating. I feel so good. <laughs> yes, I feel so good. I did go upstairs and change my clothes because I wanted to be comfortable. And so I was like, you know what, let's go take that off and get comfortable so we can get this done. Okay, let's get it done. So I'm going to clean up the dining room and I'm going to fold these clothes. I did get those marble trays from Ross. I could not pass them up. I just couldn't, guys. They were so beautiful. I'll show y'all them up close and everything in another video. But anyway, I'm going to get the table cleaned off and then I'm going to start doing laundry and eventually I will get the entire dining room nice and clean and everything will be packed and I'm just feeling good. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. So before I could pack anything, I had to get the clothes folded so I can see what I had available to use for the kids, for the twins. This is mostly the twin stuff. There's a few things in here for London, and I believe that's it. Maybe little Chris, but for the most part, it was the twins. So with this Airbnb that we had, we also had to bring our own sheets and pillowcases. So I made sure that I washed enough sheets and pillowcases for everyone as well. So I just wanted to make sure that everything was laid out. I could go through it. And then once I have everything folded, I'm going to start packing for the twins. I did pick them up some new, what are they called, water shoes from Target. One pair was $12, I believe, and 50 cent, and the other pair was $15. I did look in Five Below. I also looked in Walmart, and I believe I looked in Burlington, but no one had their size when it came to water shoes, guys. So I had to just get what I could get. They wore them for a minute, and then they were like, I don't want to wear these. I'm very big on when you go to the beach having water shoes. I did take my water shoes off for a moment, but for the most part, I put my I had my water shoes on because I don't I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Also, we did go to did I say this? I'm not sure. The the water park. We went to Jolly Rogers Water Park. We also went to the beach, which you'll see. We went to two different beaches. So, yeah, I wanted to make sure that we all had water shoes. And then I gave London my old water shoes, which were pink. There's nothing wrong with them, but I have my toes done and they're kind of squared, my big toe. And so it was rubbing up against the shoe and I didn't like the way that felt. So that's why I got me new water shoes, <laughs> but London could fit those perfectly. So yeah, now that I'm almost done folding all of these clothes, I'm going to start packing the twins bag and they were able to use those bags. It fit all of their stuff in there, their pajamas, their clothes, their shoes, like everything fit perfectly. And I'm so glad because they were so reasonable at Ross. So definitely check Ross out first if you're going on a little trip or you need a bag like that overnight bag. 
perfect guys perfect so i ended up packing the twins six outfits they had um three night outfits and then they also had swimsuits two swimsuits and the water shoes and of course their undergarments cubes from TJ Maxx came in handy. I always use the gallon size bags when I'm packing. It just makes it easier for them to grab out an outfit. And I did keep their water shoes and their swimsuits and stuff separate. Their night clothes were separate. And then I kept their outfits separate as well. So everything worked out perfectly. And like I said, I always use the gallon size baggies as well to keep their stuff. There was a washer and dryer, which I'll give you a full tour of everything coming up the house tour and everything but there was a washer and dryer in our airbnb and so i was able to wash a lot of the laundry i did come home with some dirty clothes but i think it's only like a load maybe one load of dirty clothes which is not bad so anyway i'm going to finish packing their stuff and then that'll be it for this video and then i do i pack linda's stuff guys i'm not sure if i pack her stuff in this video or not but the next video will be us on our first day on vacation so I'm feeling pretty good I'm feeling pretty good I was able to accomplish a lot on this day and yeah it just I'm super excited I'm super excited for family time vacation just loving on my family and everything worked out perfectly so thank you all so, so much for watching. If you made it to the end, leave me a suitcase emoji. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Don't want nobody but you. Keeping it between us two.